Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be talking about a new product from Mom Cozy, which is their new lactation massager. And this actually is a warmer and a massager at the same time. Um, it has six vibration modes, which are a little bit different. It has a heating element, so it can warm at the same time, and it's also waterproof, so you can use it in the shower if you're needing it to help bust up clogged ducts. Let's talk about the uses for this, and I'll give you my personal thoughts on it in this video. My name is Cassie Reyes. I am a lactation consultant, registered nurse, and a new mom to a baby girl. And we have had our experiences of, of challenges during our lactation journey in the beginning. And actually I found lactation massager to be pretty helpful for this. Uh, what is a massager for in general? We would use it to help bust up clogged ducts, and it can also be really helpful for um, stimulating a letdown if you're a person who, especially if you're pumping and it's not quite the same as when your baby's latched, you're having a hard time having a letdown, um, a massager can help with stimulating a letdown as well. So let's go ahead and open this. Comes in this little tray and it has um, a magnetic charger here, so you just plug it in and it's good to go, but it does come a little bit charged. So you turn it on here and it starts one vibration mode. You kind of have to press it for a long press to get it to start, and then you do short presses to get it to switch from one vibration mode to the other. See if you can hear this. Okay, and then another long press turns it off. You can also turn on the warmer, so you do a long press, and it has three different settings for the warmer. So one wave, two waves, and three waves, and you also just rotate through them like this. And you can use the warmer without the vibration, the vibration without the warmer, or you can use both together. So how do you use this to bust up clogged ducts? Have it on. Um, say that you have a clogged duct towards the back of your tissue. You can use the massager gently to loosen that up, but what's really gonna help is to massage somewhere between the clog and the nipple itself. So you can kind of massage it back and forth here. And while you're nursing or pumping, you can use the whole, because it's a nice curved smooth edge, you can use it to massage and kind of gently press the milk forward while your baby's nursing or while you're pumping. Why is it so important to get out those clogged ducts? Um, because if a duct is clogged, the milk can't get out. And when the milk isn't being emptied, this can in turn lead to a an infection called mastitis. So there are other ways to help get out a clogged duct, but this can be a great tool in your toolbox. If, for more information on how to get rid of a clogged duct using a silicone pump, you can check out my video on the silicone pump or the Haka. I'm also really excited to tell you guys all about the new class that I'm working on. It's going to be completely online. It's a quick lactation crash course for busy parents. So especially for those of you who, have, who are expecting, if you haven't done a lactation class yet, this is great. The first lesson walks you through deciding what your lactation journey is going to look like, whether that's exclusive pumping, exclusive latching, or some mix. And then we walk you through the basics for the first one to three days of lactation, the basics of making milk and of protecting your nipples from the start and lots of other good stuff in there. So that's coming out in March. If you're interested in joining, I'm going to leave a link down below. So how can you use this when you're pumping? Some people who experience a slow letdown, either while their baby's latching or while they're pumping, find that the milk lets down and the milk let down, um, I'm gonna do a video on that too, but when your milk lets down, it's the response you have to 
suction and stimulation and your milk moves from the further back part of the breast or chest forward and this can help stimulate that letdown. If you're switching from one pump to another, for example, the Spectra has a little bit of a vibration to it naturally and that helps a lot of people get out more milk, but your body can become programmed to expecting that little bit of a vibration for your milk to let down. And if you wanna to switch to another pump, for example, like a Baby Buddha or a Medela or any other electric pump that doesn't have that vibration like the Spectra, some people find that adding this in can be helpful in making their pump work a little bit better, help them get that let down, and help them get out more milk. Full disclosure, this was sent to me by Mom Cozy, but what do I think of it? Before I had this, I had experienced clogged ducts, and I used uh, an electric toothbrush <laughs> to help get the clog out. And then after receiving this, I've been kind of waiting because I have some recurrent plug ducts that happen. So I was waiting for it to happen again so I could give it a good try. Um, and I like the idea of having the massager over the toothbrush just because the toothbrush is concentrated in like one specific spot because the toothbrush is like a skinny tube. Whereas this is wider, you can use the whole thing to massage. It has a smooth finish, so it feels okay on your skin and it has the different modes and the warming at the same time. So while a toothbrush or anything in your house that vibrates um, works, this is a little bit more luxurious feeling, I would say. So you don't need this per se, but it does work really well for working out clog ducts. And the warming feature is really nice too. This product does sell on Amazon for $29.99 and I'm going to find out about doing a giveaway for you all. So I'll leave the information for that down in the description. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Remember to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell down below so you get notified every time I post a new video. And I'm really excited to see you all again soon. And remember, never give up on your hardest day.